So I've got the LiDAR camera hooked up to the system, concurrently with a D435, but it's not being used right now. <clears throat> and we have it working perfectly in the LumoPlay software. So let's put a game on the wall and give her a shot. Hey Cooper, you want to play the game for me? Here's the uh, RealSense D435 with the OOD filter on it. It appears to be prone to self-detection of the lighter parts of the screen. Anywhere with high contrast is showing as a black hole in the depth feed. Uh, it also seems to be uh, susceptible to light interference, like from this flashlight. So anywhere, if this was set up in a, uh, a room that had light pouring in a window or in a doorway, then we would get dead zones wherever this light would be present. This is the same setup as before, except now it's using the uh, D515 LiDAR camera. It sees no holes from any of the uh, on-screen projection, and shining a flashlight on it, aside from washing out the projection, is not detected in any way by the LiDAR sensor. This makes it much easier to configure the system as outside interference is no longer a factor.